Welcome back to Aviation This Week. Today's edition is brought to you by Lavero Aviation, your aviation solutions provider. I'm John Robinson, editor of Wings and Helicopters, and this is your aviation news. Your top story. Bell provides more details about its V247 Vigilant Tilt Rotor UAS. Then Airbus Helicopters officially begins 3D printing of A350 components. And CRJ is certified for higher maintenance intervals. We'll have all your aviation news right after this quick message from our sponsor. First introduced at the start of the year, on September 22nd in Washington, Textron subsidiary Bell Helicopter released more details about the V247 Vigilant Tilt Rotor, an unmanned aerial system that, according to the company, will combine the vertical lift capability of a helicopter with the speed and range of a conventional fixed-wing aircraft. Introduced in a shipborne design, Bell states the unmanned aircraft could be available for production as early as 2023. Some of the planned highlights of the Vigilant include 250 knots cruise speed, 180 knots endurance speed, and greater than 300 knots at maximum continuous power. It aims to have a 450 nautical miles mission radius and time on station of 11 hours. A blade fold wing stow design will allow the V247 Vigilant to fit inside a DDG hangar space and two can be loaded on a C-17 aircraft. Categorized as a Group 5 UAS, Bell explains the Vigilant is designed for a range of mission sets, including electronic warfare, intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance, escort, C4, persistent fire missions, and tactical distribution. Airbus helicopters in Germany officially began initial stage production of latch shafts for the doors of A350 passenger aircraft using 3D manufacturing. The latch shafts are made using an EOS M404 printer and are composed of titanium powder. 3D printing latch shafts are 45% lighter and 25% cheaper to produce than traditional ones. As each A350 has 16 latch shafts, Airbus explains producing these parts using 3D printing leads to a saving of just over 4 kilos per aircraft. Airbus Helicopters plans to deliver 2,200 components a year once production is fully operational. Qualification is scheduled to be complete at the end of 2018, with serial production starting in early 2019. The first A350 components are set to take to the skies in 2020. The Federal Aviation Agency granted approval for maintenance interval escalations of Bombardier CRJ-700, CRJ-900, and CRJ-1000 aircraft. The line maintenance interval, A-check, is extended to 800 flight hours, and the heavy maintenance interval, C-check, to 8,000 flight hours. Bombardier describes this as the longest maintenance intervals on the regional jet market, that CRJ series operators can now take advantage of 14% less maintenance days. The maintenance intervals explains Bombardier have doubled since the launch of the CRJ aircraft family, which first flew in May 1999. This is Annex Business Media's Niche TV. Thanks again to our sponsor, Lavero Aviation, your aviation solutions provider. And make sure to tune in to our next episode on Friday, October 5th for the latest in aviation news.